Welcome everyone. Do you want to prepare a PPT with a MOF transition? Then let's start. Take a blank slide. Right click. Go to format background. Select gradient fill and choose a gray shade and off white color for the first and second gradient stop. Now close the format background. Select rounded rectangle and insert into the blank slide. Adjust the height and width to 2. Hold the orange button and make it little round. Duplicate three times and place it like this. Now make the second and third rounded rectangle into completely round form by holding on the orange button. Select the shapes together. Go to merge shapes and choose fragment. Now delete the rounded rectangles. Select the round shapes together. Go to shape outline and choose no outline. Again, select the shapes and press Ctrl G to group them. Turn it 90 degree and duplicate two times. Now turn the first and third shape to 45 degree and the middle shape needs to be turned opposite side facing the first and third shape. Now place it like this. Click on the middle shape, right click and choose bring to front. Go to format shape. Now select the shapes together, go to gradient fill and choose red color for the first and second gradient stops. Adjust the angle to 40 degree, go to effects option, click on preset and choose offset center, blur to 42 points and angle 10 degree. Now draw an oval shape, adjust the height and width to 1.5. Go to gradient fill and choose any off white color. Select offset center from the preset shadow option. Then go to 3D format and choose the first option from the top B level. Adjust the height to 12 points and width to 3.5 points. Blur to 13 points. Duplicate the shapes 3 times and insert on the remaining ones. Now draw a text box. Type 01. Make it bold. Choose Arial Black and font size 36. Duplicate 3 times and change the number to 2, 3 and 4. Select the number 1 and this particular area. Press Ctrl G to group them. Right click and send to back. Select number 4 and this particular shape. Press Ctrl G and then Right click, send to back. Next, select the middle shape and press Ctrl G. Make sure this shape needs to be in the front. Duplicate the slide. Now, give title and subtitle to your presentation. Go to animation, select wipe. Start with previous, duration 1 second, delay 0.25 seconds. Same animation to be given for the other three. So select on the title, go to animation painter and keep it on the second one. Same process to be followed for the remaining ones. Go to the first slide. Rotate the first, second and third shapes to 90 degree. Select three shapes together. Go to shape format, align middle and align center. Drag the shape downward. If you want, you can give a transition effect also. So here I am uh, giving airplane transition. Now go to the second slide and choose morph transition. Untick the mouse click. Go to the first slide and click on the slideshow to see your result. Amazing, right? If you found this PPT useful and creative, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.